Hi Kickstarters, my name is Michael Peterson and I am here to introduce the Hot Shot. It is the first organic herbicide sprayer that really works. Imagine yourself out in your garden and you have a satchel on your side that's about the size of a laptop computer. It's got a wand on the end of it and you take the wand, you point it at a weed, you pull the trigger and the weed is bathed in 200 degree water that's laced with a little bit of acid the weed dies. Right now, the uh, Hotshot is in a prototype form. I built it from ex uh, parts of an espresso machine that I tore apart. You actually have an espresso machine in your hand, and the business end of it is at the end of the wand. So it looks like something out of Mad Max. Uh, the videos that you have been looking at that show the uh, the hot shot as it is now, the prototype as it is now, show an electric cord plugged into the back of the hot shot, but it has got its own self-contained water source. The hot shot that will be available commercially will be connected to your hose. So there will be a line running to your hose and there will also be an electrical line running to your household current. It's going to make lawn care easier. It's going to make the use of Roundup less because you don't have to go now for Roundup in the garage and put it on a plant. You can go out there and you can shoot the plant. It takes about 10 to 15 seconds to kill a weed. It works on soft bodied weeds. It doesn't work on uh, hard bodied weeds. If you have a, a thicket of blackberries in your backyard, this is not the solution that you want. But if you have weeds that are persistent that keep growing back and you don't want to use Roundup, this is the perfect opportunity. There are times when the root is very strong and very deep and you can then take the tip of the wand and put it right next to the root in the ground and force hot water down along the root channel. This kills the root farther down from the top, makes it very difficult for the root to grow back. In addition, if you have vinegar in or if you have acid in the mix at that point, you are also poisoning the ground for regeneration. It doesn't kill any of the microbes in the ground. They just go dormant until the next rain. The next rain will wash the acid out, will neutralize it, and you'll be back to normal soil. So you haven't damaged the soil, but you have diminished the root's ability to regenerate because you have put a desiccant in the ground, and that is hard on the plant. So the hot water and the uh, acid together make it very difficult for the plant to regenerate. Weeding is not fun for any gardener. It's, uh, there's no way to make it fun to go out there, get down on your hands and knees, crawl around through your garden, and dig up weeds for the second, third, or fourth time. You really want them to be gone the first time, which is another advantage of a hot shot because you, you don't have to kneel, you don't have to bend down. There's no overspray, there's no drift, and it's, it's very easy, and it's almost 100% lethal. Sometimes the weeds will try to grow back and you give them a second shot and they give up. The eventual hot shot is going to be very civilized. It will be very easy to use and uh, compact. Right now I have engineering work to do that is going to take it from the espresso parts mounted on a 1x6 board and put it into the satchel or the valise. So this is a message to all gardeners out there and everybody who is uh, tired of lawn care on your hands and knees. The Hotshot is going to make an alternative to Roundup and other uh, petroleum-based herbicides. This is an opportunity to keep your soil healthy and to make life easier for yourself. The Hotshot is going to be able to provide you with a means for easy lawn and garden care. And if you're a landscape professional, if you have to take care of a golf course and you're tired of going out on the greens and pulling out the weeds one by one, imagine going out there with your golf cart, pointing the lawn at a weed on the green, spraying it, and moving on. The weed is dead, your work is done.